Let's create flip text effect in Adobe Illustrator. I have kept my document size to 1080 by 1080 pixels with a resolution of 300. So let's get started by selecting the rectangle tool and make a big square covering the artboard as a background. Then let's select the eyedropper tool and select the background color. Then select the selection tool and in layers panel, lock the background so we don't move it by mistake. Now let's select the type tool and type the word. We are using the font Arial Black and font size is 300. Now let's select the selection tool and click on Windows, then click on Align. Make sure your Align to Artboard is enabled. Now click on the Horizontal Align option. Then right click on the text and select Create Outlines. Now click on the Edit Toolbar option and select Free Transform Tool. Click on the text once and you will get the Transform options. From here, select the Perspective Distort option. Now take your cursor to the bottom corner and left click and drag it inwards like so. Once you're satisfied, select the selection tool and hold Alt plus left click and drag to make a duplicate. Now take your cursor to the middle point and drag to scale it down like this. Now select the text and horizontal align it. Then select both the text and go to objects and then click on blend and click on blend options. Keep spacing to specified steps and keep value to two and click on okay. Now go again in objects, then click on blend and click on make and we'll get something like this. Now go in objects and click on expand. Make sure object and fill is ticked and click on okay. Now let's ungroup them. You can do it from the contextual taskbar or by right clicking and selecting ungroup. Now select the bottom text and move it up a little using the up arrow key. Now let's select all the text and go in Windows, then click on Gradient. Then click on the down arrow and select the white and black option, then set the angle to minus 90. Now click on the white dot and select eyedropper tool and select the color you want. Now do the same with the black dot. We are done with the top half. Let's create the bottom half. Select all and right click, then click on transform and then click on Reflect. Keep the axis to horizontal and click on Copy. Now manually align it. Then select all the text and right click and click on Group. Now align it to the center and we are done. Hope you liked the tutorial. Hope you got to learn something new. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial.